It's a close look that few people get to see, and there are even places we can't show you. But at the Peach Bottom Atomic Power Station, one thing that's not hidden is safety. In an emergency where power is lost, four diesel tanks the size of locomotives in this watertight building are the first line of defense. We have enough diesel fuel oil on site to run all four diesels for seven consecutive days at full load. But it doesn't stop there. There are backup batteries plus nine different water supplies to keep reactors cool if needed. We understand systems will fail no matter what, no matter how good the components are, and they are very good here, sooner or later something will fail. So what we do is we build barriers such that any failure can be tolerated. Safety starts with employees. They get special training nearly every month. Every five weeks, the operators go back over to the training center in a simulator. This is our simulator Peach Bottom. They're tested on various um, scenarios like we just saw. Uh, they get classroom training and written exams to make sure that we are all assured that they can do their jobs. In this simulation room, they prepare for all types of emergencies. In the next five years, Exelon will spend $1.3 billion on upgrades at Peach Bottom on top of their yearly improvements. We change out systems, change out pumps, components all the time. And for those that aren't changed out, we, we do testing on them maintenance, preventative maintenance. We have tens of thousands of preventative maintenance tasks that we do every year on our plant to make sure that it's going to be reliable. The Peach Bottom Atomic Power Station opened in 1974 and provides power to more than 2 million homes and businesses in Pennsylvania and Maryland. In Delta, Dara Reese, ABC 27 News.